Uh, my name's Ian Bent and I'm the National Football Development Manager at the Independent Schools Football Association. It's fantastic to be here today at LVS Ascot School for their annual Girls Football Festival. There's over 300 girls participating here today, right the way from the 9 and 10 year olds in the new 11 age group all the way through to the in the 15 age group. It's fantastic to also have them all here on the same site as well. The fantastic facilities here at LVS Ascot enable the school to run the event for all 300 plus girls all at the same time. Uh, it's also fantastic to have Arsenal women here today uh, supporting the event, putting on the coaching masterclasses um, uh, throughout the day which gives them not only an opportunity to play in their matches but also an opportunity to practice their skills and get some expert tips and advice that will help them um, in, their, in their games. Uh, my name is Daniel and uh, I work for uh, Arsenal Ladies. Um, basically, today we're here at um, LVS in Ascot and uh, we've been brought in today just to deliver master classes in between uh, all the games that are going on here. Uh, basically, getting the players to improve their 1v1 dribbling, encouraging the individual, the 1v1, being strong in 1v1 battles. Um, and this is also supported by this wonderful facility that we're in today. So, as, as you can see, there's a lot of, a lot of space, a lot of fields here. This is the, the third year of the festival and it keeps growing year on year with record numbers here uh, this year and is a real sign of the growth of girls football, particularly within the independent school sector, to have so many schools here and some travelling such a long way as well. Um, schools travelling from uh, Middlesbrough, such as Red House School, Ipswich, Cambridge, um, all to come here today as well as some more local schools as well.